African Union peacekeepers have handed over a forward operating base to Somalia security forces. Saturday's ceremony marked the first time such a facility has been transferred to Somali military hands. In what is to be a transition, removing the Atmos forces from the country. Burundi troops formerly manned the compound. The base is in Masla, five kilometers north of Mogadishu. Geographically, it has also enabled our troops to secure the major supply route connecting Mogadishu and the hinterland, hence ensuring the safe and secure movement of goods and services which is important for both economic and social development of this country. The ceremony included Somalia's State Minister for Defense, Abdinur Fidal. He expressed hope that Atmos would continue to support the Somali National Army as it attempts to defeat terrorist forces. Huge military gains have been achieved in the past few months, and we are keen to double the current efforts and count on your support in eradicating the Al-Shabaab. I therefore request the support and cooperation. The Ugandan the commander in charge of Atmos forces agreed with his host. He also expressed confidence that Masla would be turned into an effective base for creating better security in the capital. I have no doubt that our SNA brothers who have taken over the Ford operating base are equal to the task ahead of them. Atmos forces remain ready to partner with Somali security forces in furtherance of core security ideals in the Hershebeli region and Somalia in general. The handover shows confidence in the increased capabilities of the Somali army. Another important development that may help Somalia came from the political head of Atmos. Going forward, we will prioritize good environmental practices in all our military operations. As a bold step, we are going green in all our forward operating bases by using environmentally friendly technology to power our water and energy needs. Bringing green energy technology to Somalia and implementing it in the short run can be a huge benefit. With African Union forces due to leave at the end of 2024, this infrastructure can stay behind and help Mogadishu develop its own green energy resources. Addressing the country's security as well as promoting a green future shows the relationship with the AU can benefit Somalia far into the future. ADN TV will continue to report on security and energy developments across Africa.